Autodesk Vault is able to manage any file of any type. Obviously it's able to manage Inventor and AutoCAD data through the add-ins that we've seen already. Uh, Microsoft Office also has an add-in, but even at that rate we're not limited to just think uh, applications that have add-ins for, for direct integration with the Vault client. Any file of any type is able to be managed by the Vault. Just the workflow that you might use to manage that is a little bit different. Um, this next little segment here, I want to show you how to use the add-in in the uh, Microsoft Office suite and also how to manage other files, let's say a picture file uh, with the Vault. So what I'm going to do here is I've already brought up Microsoft Excel and I've already uh, shown the Vault tab. I'm ready to log in. The same credentials I've been using all throughout this, this demonstration. So I'll go ahead and say OK to this. So I'm just going to create a very simplistic spreadsheet here that uh, I'll use to check in and out of the vault. So my next step would be to save this file. So I'm going to go ahead and save this. And I want to make sure that I save it under C local workspace. Inside my, dot, my designs folder, I'm going to create a new folder here, call it Office Docs. I'll just call it, I'll just let it be called Book One. So, so I'll save this. And I'll check it into the vault. Just like any other scenario, if I try to click in here and try to make uh, some sort of change, I need to uh, check it out. Let's update some properties, that's okay. I make my changes, save it, check it back in. I'm actually able to preview this file in the vault. If I do a refresh back here, here's my Office Docs folder. I click on this file. You see here I have a previewer and I can navigate through I got my different sheets I can look at as well. Okay. So now let's add a picture to the vault and kind of work through the workflow of how you would manage that as well. Uh, since it doesn't have an add-in, what I'll do is I'm going to just right click on this Office Docs folder. And I'm going to say Add Files. This will give me the ability to kind of browse around and find something on my C drive that I want to I want to add to the vault. I'm just going to go to a picture this my pictures directory here and grab a sample picture uh, of maybe these penguins to add to the vault. So as soon as I pick it, it's, it's ready to go. It's ready to check this in. So I'll say OK. Now in order to check it out to work on it, what I'll do is I'll right click on this, say get slash checkout. And I'll check this box here to tell it that I want to check this file out. So I'll say OK. Once I have that file checked out, what I can do is I can then open up an application that would enable me to open the file and modify it. So in my case here, I'm going to actually open up Microsoft Paint. And if I go to C, local workspace, there's designs, there's office docs, there's that penguins file. At this point here, I'm able to maybe just uh, maybe make a couple little changes to this. Save this. I'll close it. So then, when I go back over to the to my vault, I'll right-click, 
check in, it will reach out to that location and pull the file in. You can see here if I look at my preview of that file, you can see it's now showing those changes I've made.